Constantine. My dear cousin. I'm always happy to see you. What news do you bring? We managed to solve the problem of the attacks on San Mateus. Really? So what was causing them? The city and its outposts were continuously being attacked by animals. These beasts were led by a large creature that strangely resembled a mountain guardian. This is the same creature which High King Vinbar turned into, isn't it? Exactly. Except it looked sick and it didn't act like the High King did. It was calling the animals around it and it seemed like it was transferring its disease to them before making them attack. I have never seen anything like it. And there's more. Hikmet was in a similar situation. Do you remember? Of course. Don't tell me that a guardian was involved there as well. Yes. The governor was convinced that the attacks were led by the islanders. And yet they were being attacked as well. By their side that I fought the creature. That time, Nardai Glen, a beach guardian. But just the sick. And it was also manipulating the animals to make them So, it would be some kind of epidemic affecting the guardians. I don't see what we can do about it. Actually, I think you've already done what had to be done by eliminating those that were threatening our neighbors. Perhaps. But I'm certain there's more to it than a simple epidemic. These beasts attack in a coordinated fashion, which requires an intelligence that they don't have. You're exaggerating, dear cousin. The attacks you thought were coordinated may just have been coincidental. You may be right, but I can't help thinking that someone is behind all this. Do you really believe that a Danegad would want to take over the island? Cousin, you know how much I respect you, but frankly, this doesn't seem very coherent. But I see it's already quite late. If you'll excuse me, dear cousin. Regrettably, I must leave you. Where are you going? Not very far, rest assured. But I have a small personal matter to take care of, you see. Don't be concerned. There's absolutely no risk. Use the opportunity to take some rest. You've really performed miracles recently. See you later. But why would he leave like that? God, do you know where my cousin is going? Sorry, Your Excellency. His Highness didn't tell me anything. You are one of his bodyguards, aren't you? I am, Your Excellency. But recently, it has been difficult to force His Highness to accept our presence. Recently? You mean this isn't the first time he's left without an escort? I... I'm sorry, Your Excellency. You better tell me everything. But I... Fine. I don't mean to be disrespectful towards him. But His Highness's behavior has been very... peculiar recently. He sleeps very little. And goes out alone almost every night. And it didn't occur to anyone that I should be informed? Well, His Highness had specifically ordered us not to tell you about it. And where does he go? I thought the days when he used to go from tavern to tavern were over. He... he doesn't go to taverns, Your Excellency. From what I know, he... he goes outside the city. Where could he go outside the city? I've no idea. We saw him going north. That's all I know. Listen. I understand this matter is putting you in a difficult situation. You were supposed to protect my cousin wherever he went, but he refused and ordered you to keep your mouth shut. But Constantine is not just my governor. He's my cousin. I'm worried about him. He's already been abducted once when leaving the city. So, if you know anything else... I don't really know where he's going, Your Excellency. But I think I know where you could find out. When he doesn't leave the palace, he stays in his office for hours. He writes so much down in there that he could fill entire books. Here, I have the key. Take it. I hope you find His Highness and manage to make him see reason. I don't like this at all. What could he be doing outside every night? Normally, I would have said getting drunk at the tavern. But clearly, that isn't the case. I'm starting to believe that the revelations of the Frictiman had some truth to them. Let's rummage through his papers. We may find a clue.
don't have the key. like this at all. What could he be doing outside every night? Normally I would have said getting drunk at the tavern. But clearly that isn't... I'm starting to believe that the revelations of Enon Mi... Il Frichtemann had some truth to them. Let's rummage through his papers. We may find a clue. It can't be easy to discover that your cousin has hidden witness. But we can't let him kill these people simply because he's afraid they might have seen him.
May the trees on your road always bear fruit. Thanks. You saved us. These beasts would have torn us to shreds. These animals were strange, as if they were enraged. Thanks again, Renaixi. And perhaps you can do me a favor in return. I'm looking for a young man, a Renaixi. But he looks a bit like an Onol Manawi. Someone like you? In some ways. But his marks are different, darker. He's talking about the crazy Don Egad. Indeed, that might be him. Do you know where to find him? No, we see him passing by around nightfall, but we don't know where he's going. He walks along the path, often followed by some beasts. He has a sinister look in his eyes. He scares me, so we stay hidden. And you do well to hide. I think he's the one who sent these animals to attack you. Do you have any idea how I could figure out where he's going? He could hide in the old house. He would see him passing by and could follow, couldn't he? You're right. If you take this path to the right, you'll reach an abandoned house. You can hide there. And from up there, you will be able to see the path perfectly. Thank you. You've been a great help. And stay hidden. You may still be in danger. Be prudent, Onol Manawi. You're very isolated here. Why live so far from a village? It's a long story. Matir, will you tell him? When I was young, I got engaged to a young man. But he wasn't my Menondanem. I thought he was, but I was wrong. And one day, I met the one I would love for all my life. As I had broken my engagement, we were exiled. So, our parents came to settle here. They built this house, and we were born. There. Now you know the whole story. Do you want to know anything else? I'll leave you alone. Kwa awalem se. We can't be seen from the path. Let's wait here where Constantine goes. I see him. And he's not alone.
opened a passage for himself here. Let's follow him quick. Constantine, what are you doing? Cousin! You're here! I, I would have preferred that you learn all of this another way. To be able to reveal everything to you in better circumstances. But whatever power we earn, there are some things that escape. I've seen monsters. I'm well aware of that. But I promise everything when the moment is right. Then you will understand. You will see. The temptation is so great to share all with you right now. You have done so much for me. You have given me so much. I haven't forgotten, believe me. But I still have more to do. Forgive me and have patience. Hold them back. But do not kill him for anything in the world. Constantine, come back and explain yourself. Do you think I taught this spoiled brat how to... We are the And now he's throwing... Beasts at us. He's gone mad. He's the...
with you. You saw him fall from me. Steal my children, my guardians. Pervert my force. Yes, but I don't understand. What he does? Strength. Power. It is what they all want. Those who take without looking beyond themselves. Like all those from the faraway lands. He wasn't like that. He couldn't care less about all that. Then it is the sickness. him to the point it changed who he is. You must stop him. He destroys me a little more. of his folly, yes. Believe me, there is no other solution. Stop him, flesh of my earth, or there will be nothing left to save. I still can't believe this. I understand what you feel. I have trouble believing it myself, but... Enon Milfrichtum never lies. We need to stop your cousin by any means possible. We must learn more if we want to understand his plans and prepare against them. This hiding place he's talking about in his note. We must find it. If in his folly he remembered just a small bit of what I taught him, then he shall warn his guard to be ready for us. We will need to be discreet and find ourselves allies. You're thinking of all the creatures that he has perverted. A veritable army. Precisely. And again, we will soldiers. Natives will follow you because their god has ordered it. We might also be able to count on help from the Nords. We'll need to speak to their admiral. We should also be able to count on Sieglinde. Her troops will be all the more welcome. And of course, we can also go and find the Mother Cardinal, as well as Governor Buren. <sighs> what an absurd project. On the continent, they would brand us crazy, but not here. On an island where everything is possible, and all folly is accepted. Let us go. We need to put an end to all of this.
Your Eminence, I salute you. Sir de Sardé, what can I do for you? Do you remember I thought that someone must have been responsible for the attacks you sustained? Yes, you thought that this guardian who sent us the animals couldn't have been acting alone. And I was right, sadly. You're hesitating. Are you afraid of my reaction? Indeed. As the person responsible is none other than my cousin, Constantine. Uh, does this mean that the congregation has decided to wage war on us? And thanks to which obscure alliance has your cousin been able to manipulate these creatures? Constantine acted alone, and he betrayed us as much as he betrayed you, believe me. As for the way he manipulated these creatures, do you remember that my cousin was sick? Absolutely. And it is said that his recovery was the result of a rather suspicious miracle. Are you telling me that your cousin has made a pact with the demons of this island? Something like that. He was cured by a Donegad of the island who performed a bonding ritual. But the power he received from this made him thirsty for more, and he bonded himself to other places, thus gaining control over the guardians who were protecting these sacred places. But why attack us? Did his madness make him forget about our alliance? His thirst for power is making him want to control the island entirely by himself. And I know that for this purpose he will soon attack the native's main sanctuary on the volcano. I won't stand a chance against all the creatures he's taken control of. And I need some help. I will go and find the other factions, of course. But we need the help of Teleme. Having a common enemy should help us forget all the differences that have been opposing us. The idea that we would protect the Sanctuary from an insular demon is completely insane. But you have helped us several times, and I trust your judgment. You can count on our help. My might by your side. Thank you, Your Eminence. Thanks to your wisdom, we have a chance to prevail. I must leave you. Naturally, Your Excellency. Your Excellency, 
Lord Dusade, and to what do I owe this honor? I have come to solicit your help and to propose we forge an alliance. An alliance? Against whom? You remember, no doubt, the attacks that fell upon Hikmed, but also San Mateus, and against the natives. Of course. You told me that different guardians sent the beasts. Precisely. And the guardians were manipulated by someone. I discovered who it was. This revelation will not please you, but I have no choice but to tell you. It is Constantine. Jest. What is the meaning of this? Do you know how many men have died during these attacks? Allow me to continue, I beg you. My cousin's sickness shook him to the core. Then, there was a ritual and his capture. And Constantine has fallen into madness. He has been increasing these rituals in order to link himself to the island, to gain power and manipulate its creatures. He is fighting a war against everyone, and it now appears he wants to take control of Tirfredi. He is preparing to attack the Volcano Sanctuary, and I need help to stop him. It is in the name of the Congregation that I come to see you. Constantine betrayed us as well. That's madness. It is complete madness. All of this superstitious nonsense. These absurd theories. I believed you sincere, Disarde. Which does not mean that I believe you now. But no matter. You are in need of men to stop your cousin who has already attacked us? Precisely. I have already gathered support, but I need as many allies as possible. Let us be clear. I don't believe for an instant that this story has a link to the island or whatever foolishness. But I do trust you. You have rendered us valuable services and have supported us. And since we cannot allow the crimes of your cousin to go unpunished, we will stand beside you. Thank you, Excellency. Thank you. You have improved our chances of success tenfold. I have to go. Look forward to seeing you again. Farewell, my lord. Desarde, what can I do for you? I have come to ask for your help, Admiral. My cousin has been plunged into madness, and he apparently wishes to conquer the whole island. He took control of many creatures by reenacting rituals he learned from the islanders, and now he uses them to attack the cities and the villages of those he considers to be his rivals. A difficult situation, admittedly, but one that does not concern us. Who's in charge of the island is none of our business, Desarde, and you know that. It actually does concern you. If my cousin takes control of the island, soon there will be no ports where your ships can berth. He's not looking for political influence. He desires power. 
absolute power. I see. It's a decent argument. So what now? We must stop him at all costs. And for that, I will need allies. I already have the support of other factions, but I was hoping I could count on the help of the Norts. You can. My men aren't really used to fighting on land, but they will be by your side. You have proven time and time again that we can trust you. Thank you, Admiral. May the winds be in your favor, Desarde. You'll need all the help you can get. Excellency, it is an honor. Hello, Commander. Lord Desade. How can I be of service to you? I have come to ask for your help. I'm at your service, Your Excellency. What is it you want from me? We need reinforcements to protect the sanctuary of the islanders, north of the island. Very well. I will send some troops there. But may I ask who or what they will be fighting? Creatures, in great numbers. And probably my cousin. I beg your pardon? As your men must have told you, he has changed a lot recently. Ever since he was cured of the Malachor and bonded to the island, he has become obsessed with power. He is now targeting the heart of the island. If he succeeds, we're all doomed. I have indeed heard reports of the Governor's peculiar behavior. Since he is our employer, I asked my men to turn a blind eye. But thanks to your help, we avoided dishonor. I won't forget it. If you're telling me that we are in danger, and that we need to go to this sanctuary, we'll go. Thank you, Commander. Anything else? I have to go. Goodbye. I also have a lot to do. Until next time, Your Excellency.
What brings you here, Ono Manawi? I came to ask for your help in stopping my cousin, Dunkus. Did you hear about the attacks of creatures led by strange guardians throughout the island? Yes, Daren sent a messenger to tell me about it. My cousin was sick, and to cure him, Katasak used the bonding ritual on him. But the power he received from it made him mad, and he started bonding himself in other places. He transformed his guard each time, and used them to attack those he considers to be his rivals. What you're telling me is terrifying. Katasak and Devosh Tire should never have bonded him. Your cousin is breaking balance. He's consuming and will only want to consume Indeed, Enonmiel Frichtemann warned me that Constantin was now targeting the sanctuary at the heart of the island. I cannot fight him alone. I need allies. I already convinced some other factions to support us, but I also need the help of your people, because we must all stand together to stop the on the island. Your will to create an alliance between all the peoples on this island is wise and noble. And the call of Enomil Frichtemann cannot remain unanswered. We will be by your side in the battle. I am not a fighter, but Dedra will lead our warriors. And I would also like for you to take this weapon. I pray it will be useful in the fight that is coming. Thank you, Dunkus. Don't thank me. You managed to earn my people's trust. And you fight for a cause that affects us all. May the Earth support each of your steps. And may the volcano give you its strength. I must admit that I expected Dunkus to be more angered when he learned what Constantine had done. He's a sage among sages. Even amongst the Donegada. Enon Mil Frichtemann speaks in his ear. I think he already knew what was happening, even before we came to see him. That confirms it. I made the right choice. Tiafredi couldn't have a better High King. Hello, Glenda. Bjort Tirtomad on Olmenawi. What can I do for you? To tell you that men are going to come all the way to the sanctuary. Some Ren I thank you for coming to warn me in person. But our High King has already spoken to me. I am disgusted to warriors of the faraway island. But the decision is not mine. And in truth, we do not have the choice, do we? All of Tirfredi and Enonmiel Frichtemann that's in danger. We have need of every able warrior to protect them. You need to prepare yourself as well. I fear that you will not be spared. We will fight, have no doubts. 
Assigned is our duty and our will. These are our lands that are attacked. I have no doubt. Good luck, Glendan. May the rocks give you their toughness. You shall need it more than everyone else. Can I do anything else for you? I must leave. Goodbye. Kwa awelam seg. The cave that Constantine indicated in his note shouldn't be very far. He had... It's guards that are very loyal to him. There's a chance they'll be...
Constantine has marked places on the I recognize some of them. They are sacred places for the natives. Places of connection. This place, this journal, my poor Constantine, you have completely lost your mind. What are you hoping to achieve with these rituals? No Donegad has ever done such a thing. It goes against the balance that we are defending. Enon Mir Frichtemann was right. Your cousin wants power. He is feeding from the strength of Tyr Fredi. So much so that he's threatening Enon Mir Frichtemann himself. Wants to take his place. To think he's been plotting this absurd for weeks. He even to achieve it. The intruder is certainly by him to scout the place. We'll need to get if we're going to stop him. But we will also have to weaken him and break apart the bonds that he's established. I don't know exactly how these things work. And unless you do, I need help. How about Dunkus? Mev scares me a little. You're right. Let's go and What brings you here on Omanawi? As I've told you before, he bonded himself in many places before he decided to get the heart of the island. You did tell me, and you must know that by doing he has acquired a power no Donegada has ever possessed. I need your help. We need to break some of his bonds in order to weaken Rest. Donegada will answer to the call of death. And with death, we will heal the wound that has opened. However, to accomplish this, it is I who will need your help. 
What can I do? During the ritual, who is bonding himself spills some of his blood near the base of a stone. And this blood summons a and lifts these stones serve as a point for Take this bond is to have a guardian topple this stone. We will be able to do it, but these rituals take a long time. Too long. So in the meantime, you must prevent us from here. Take these seeds and plant them at the bottom of your cousin's bonding stones. These plants grow very fast, and their roots will prevent him from drawing the strength of Tiefradi. However, you must be careful, because the guardians corrupted by him will come to defend the stones. Thank you, Dunkers. And thank you for wanting to stop your cousin. Don't worry. I will send my people to finish the work of the plants I have given you. For a night, sir. Let's plant the seed Dunkus gave us at the
plant seems to be growing extremely far. The Donegard clan are sure to be here soon to finish breaking.
Look. The plant seems to be growing extremely fast. The Donnegarda of Dunkus' clan are sure to be here soon to finish breaking the bond. 